Oh, this is so nice. It's our first outing with the kids, and it's not doing too bad. I mean, uh, McDonald's is a good starting place, too. Yeah, I'm actually having a good time. It's just really nice to be out of the house. It's just hard to eat with two kids in your arms. I mean, I can't really use my hand, so... Mmm, oh, the fries are at least good. Hey, Rose, that was my ice cream. I was saving that. And ice cream isn't for babies. Oh, Branch, you can share with cute little Rose. And geez, you got yourself two desserts anyway. Who eats a burger with an apple pie and an ice cream? Craig, when you told me that you would take me on a date to a nice new American restaurant, I didn't think you would be taking me to McDonald's. Uh, JJ Suki, I, come on, I live in a park. Like, do you think my budget is that much? And McDonald's has been renovating, and it looks really nice and fancy now. Well, Craig, the employees here aren't even wearing clothes. How is that sanitary? I swear that's against the law. All right, well, I'll do something about it then. Hey, you, Guy Diamond, get over here. Oh, yeah. Since you work in the food industry, aren't you supposed to be wearing clothes? That is so unsanitary and gross. Oh, well, yeah, they actually did issue me a uniform. I guess I should wear it. I'll go get it. Uh, sorry, Creek, but I'm going to have to cut this date short. You see, I came here um, on the date for free food, but I didn't know it was going to be McDonald's. So, yeah, I'm going to quickly go home and try to find myself a second date that will feed me better. Ciao. <laughs> What? Did 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 she just say bum bum? Oh, she she no way, she just said glitter bum bum. What? Oh man, you know she probably said that because guy diamond just walked by with his butt hanging out of his apron. Uh, maybe the kids are just too young to take out. Oh, look at them being a perfect, beautiful, happy little family. That should be me in that family, not Branch. Oh, I should be with Poppy. And now I'm going to take matters into my own hands. La 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 la. Oh, I'm making the fries extra crispy today. Do, 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 do. And luckily, I just happened to carry around a love potion with me that I was meant to give to DJ Suki so that she would actually like me, but she left too soon. So now I can just give it to Poppy and she'll finally be in love with me. Uh-oh, Rose pooped her diaper. I better go take her to the bathroom to get it changed. <laughs> this is gonna be gross. Oh, Branch just left. Perfect timing. Now let's go use this potion. <laughs> Oh, hey, Poppy. Funny seeing you here. You Creek. Get away from me. You look disgusting and you smell kind of bad. Oh, well, I just came over here to tell you that they're coming out with a brand new Hug Time watch. It's pretty awesome. And oh, look, there's a poster for it right over there behind you. No way. Really? <laughs> hey, Creek, I don't see it. Oh, oh, just keep looking. You got to look at the details. Creek, there's no poster over there. Oh, you're such a loser. Just go back to your own table. Oh, whoops, silly me. <laughs> well, see you later my love. <laughs> Ugh, that guy is so annoying. He makes me so mad. I'm just gonna uh, eat out of anger now. <laughs> oh good, she's eating it. And now I just have to sit here and make sure she can make eye contact with me so she, we can fall in love. <laughs> oh man, I, I feel really funny. Oh, my head hurts. And oh, what, my eyes are blurry. What? Oh wow, what is over there? Oh my goodness, that is the most attractive troll I have ever seen. Okay, kids, stay here for a second. I gotta find out who this guy is. Time to take out the apple pies. La la la, this is the most satisfying job in America. I'm in love. I've never felt this way before with the most attractive troll ever. Excuse me, sir. I have never seen something so beautiful as you. Well, what a coincidence. I haven't seen anyone as beautiful as you before. Or either. I'm in love. I know it's not hug time yet, but can I hug and kiss you? Oh, absolutely. <laughs> uh, all right. Rose is nice and clean now. And hey, wait, kids, where's your mom? What? Where, where'd she go? <laughs> um, is she getting more fries? Or <gasps> what? Oh, wow, you're oh, so amazing. You're so Love you so much. Excuse me. What is going on here? And who are you? Can't I just have personal time with the troll I just fell in love with? Poppy, what on earth are you talking about? We're married with kids. Look. 
look! This kid in my arm looks exactly like you! I'm the troll of your love! Well, boo-hoo, Branch! She's my love now, just how it should be, and now we're gonna be happily married soon! Oh my goodness, is that a proposal? If so, I do! I really wanna marry you! What on earth is going on? I just went to the bathroom for three minutes, and now you wanna marry Creek? Like, what? <laughs> alright, alright, enough of this nonsense! I've seen this happen all the time! Here, Poppy, take a bite of this burger and you'll be all better. Oh man, I don't have much time. Uh, here, Poppy, kiss me. Ew, that was the most disgusting thing ever. Does anybody have hand sanitizer that I can wipe all over my face and mouth and lips? Oh, gross. Uh, yeah, I don't even know if I could kiss you for a couple days or even touch. Like, ooh, ooh, ooh. Uh, well. I enjoy it while it lasted. Oh, that's so gross. I have creek cooties. <laughs> ah! Wow, Guy Diamond, thanks for fixing that. Like, how did you know that would work and, like, break her weird love spell thing? Well, the high calorie count and high grease and fat content of these burgers helps dissolve the love potion in someone's body very quickly. Wow, well, thanks for your amazing knowledge and uh, burger potion stuff. I guess you're, uh, right, fit for the job. <laughs> If you want more trail videos, please click like and subscribe. And now we're going to play with some more Trolls toys. This is the Crayola Trolls Magic Model. And we can make our own cute little Poppy and Biggie and his little pet worm. Oh, snap. And this is like a really tiny light box. So I'm sure we're going to make like tiny, tiny Poppies and Biggies. Um, it comes with these cardboard cutouts to make their face look better. So actually, let's open this up now and we'll see kind of what it comes with. Oh yeah, see it's pretty basic. So we just have this like tiny raspberry modeling clay for Poppy. It should smell good. And then blue, <laughs> so no flavor. Um, and then, oh this is cool. I think it tells me how to make it, which that would help. Okay, so we have our Poppy face and hair and dress, very cute, and the outfits for Biggie. And then here's our instructions. Oh good, okay. So now we know exactly how to make it. This helps a lot. All right, to start, you're supposed to separate the raspberry dough into four different balls. So like a large one and then two medium ones. And it's really nice because it gives you this chart of about how big they should be. And then one small one. And this, of course, we'll use for Poppy. All right, so we're gonna begin with Poppy's head with the large ball that we made. And I'm going to flatten it out a little bit to make an oval for her face like this. There we go. And then we're supposed to put on her eyes like this. And there's two little tabs. You just kind of stick that into her head like this. And then it wants you to take the small ball of clay and just grab a tiny bit and put it over the tab just to keep it in place like this. There we go. And then we're supposed to put her hair over the top of this, just kind of like that. And you're again supposed to grab some dough and you can kind of reshape her face a little bit. <laughs> it's looking a little flat. Um, you're supposed to put dough on the sides of these tabs as well. So we'll do that. And some on the sides to keep the tabs in. And then we need to make her nose. So let me put this down here for her nose. Okay, so I'm just grabbing a little dough ball here. There's her nose, and then we gotta make her ears too. So I'm gonna give her kind of bigger ears off to the side like this. And another one off to the side. There we go, and like kind of flatten them a little bit, make them round, and yeah. I mean, that looks like Poppy, that's actually pretty good. <laughs> and then let me um, just grab a Play-Doh knife and cut a smile. There we go, happy Poppy. All right, now for the body of Poppy, you need to like take the medium ball that you made and put it inside her dress like this and then put the straps of her dress at the top of the log, just kind of fold it in place and I'll use a little bit of clay just to keep this down like this. 
And then um, we'll attach our arms and we just use the rest of the other medium ball that we have. And we'll roll out some arms here. This is really easy to use. Let's see, I think, I feel like that's too big. There we go. There we go, like this. Here's one little poppy arm. And then, can mold out another one. Another little poppy arm. Um, <laughs> these aren't the best, let's see, there we go. And then we gotta do the same thing for the legs. So I'm gonna just mix up the rest of my dough together. All right, now for the legs for Poppy. Um, basically, you just kinda mold them out to look like this, <laughs> like that. So like standing legs, there we go, like this. And then let's get her body on here. There we go, that's actually not too bad. And now the head, which is most important. You know, this has turned out really, really well. When I looked at the box, I was like, no way will mine look that good. <laughs> um, but actually, I mean, her head's a little flatter and a little wider, but otherwise she looks pretty good, I think. So um, if I could do it, you can do it too. <laughs> and so now let's, uh, let's move on to Biggie. All right, so now we're gonna do Biggie, and this one is really weird. So uh, once you take a normal piece of paper, cut it in half, and then tightly like scrunch it up into two paper balls because apparently they just don't want to give you enough molding, <laughs> enough clay to make your own is my assumption. Um, so we're going to like kind of press this together and then it wants you to stack them but wrap them with tape. So we're going to use a lot of tape I guess <laughs> for this. Yeah, this is really interesting to say the least. Um, so we're gonna do this, like kinda wrap each ball with tape just to hold it together. And then um, we gotta kinda wrap them on top of each other too, which is also weird. So kinda like this. I'll wrap some more tape. And this is gonna be like the inside, I guess, of Biggie's body. All right, so this is weird, but I got it. <laughs> so this is basically the under body of Biggie. And now it wants you to smash the big ball that you made into a pancake and we're going to cover the paper that we just made so hopefully we have yeah i think we have enough here all right and now we have these pants that we got to fit around biggie's big bottom here okay and now probably the best part the eyes so we're going to just stick these in here and I'm gonna grab a little bit of clay. It's funny how big he is and his eyes are so tiny. Okay, here's Biggie. It looks okay, but I love Poppy a lot more. And Poppy looks better just because she came with better clay. And he's kind of more of a blob. <laughs> but um, please make sure to like this video, subscribe, and then also in the comments about which one you like more. I say Team Poppy.